June 9th. Uh, today is still the review, 10, 11, and 10. So it started the in English part 11 first. A. Uh, this is about daily life, new guy in town. It's a uh, little bit a creepy one. Okay. Oh. oh, I don't know if you heard, but someone moved into that old house down the road. Yeah, I know. I met the owner of the house yesterday as he was moving in. His name is Armand. Really? What's he like? You have to fill me in. Actually, he's a bit strange. I don't know. I've got a bad feeling about him. Really? Why? Well, yesterday I brought over a housewarming gift. But Armand started acting really well, weird. And then he practically kicked me out. I tried to sort of peek into his house, but uh, everything was so dark inside that I couldn't really get a good look. The whole thing really creeped me out. Well, you'll never guess what I saw this morning. I delivery truck, a delivery truck put into his driveway, and it dropped off a long rectangular box. It almost looked like a coffin. You see? Why would he? Hello, ladies. Ah, Armand, you scared the heck out of me. This is my friend Doris. A pleasure to meet you. If you are not doing anything tonight, I would like to have you both for dinner. I mean, I would like to have you both over for dinner. What are you doing? I'm really something. Okay, here let's see at the beginning uh, what they express. I don't know if you heard. Okay, you can start. You can use this uh, sentence to start with something, with gossip or something. I don't know if you heard. And la, 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 la. I don't know if you heard or something. But something moved into the old house down the road. Yeah, I know. I met the old house yesterday as it was moving in. His name, really, what's it like? You have to fill me in. So you have to tell me with exact details. You have, you have to fill me in. Okay. For example, okay, Mary, do you fill me in the class of yesterday's okay could you feel me in the class of yesterday actually he's a bit strange i don't know i've got a bad feeling about him i've got a bad feeling about him that means they have some bad feeling about somebody bad feeling somewhat about something or somebody i have bad feeling okay about something or somebody a bad thing really why i brought her over a housewarming gift. Housewarming. So when you when somebody moved home, neighbors or friends will come and bring a gift. That is housewarming gift. Started acting really weird, and then he practically kicked me out. Out kicked me out. I tried sort of peek into his house. Just to have a look, okay, and uh, peek into. But everything was so dark inside that I couldn't really get a good look. The whole thing really creeped me out. They really creeped me out. Okay, creeped me out. Okay, just uh, make somebody afraid of fear or something. They really creeped me out. Well, the guy that I saw this morning pulled into his way. Just stop there. Put into. Come and stop. They pulled into. And he dropped a long record. See what I you the scare the hack out of me you scare the heck out of me okay and the things okay let's see the number 10 what would have this one it's 10 about the office driving sales oh this was so many times we 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 heard this one all right people we are holding this meeting today because we've got to do something about ourselves and we need to do it now one concrete conclusions uh, concrete solutions. How do you plan to drive self? Roger. Well, well. In fact, uh, we we are the most expensive in the market. So maybe we need to lower our prices uh, to match the compet competitors. Competitor. Competitors. Lower our prices? Not very creative. It will never fly with one. What kind of thinking is that? Jeez. Anybody else have a better plan? Natalie. Um, perhaps um, a promotion, maybe a two for one offer, or something like that. What? That's the same thing. Bad idea. Really bad idea. 
damn it, people, come on, think. The CEO will be here any minute. Do we have any ideas yet? Yes, Mr. Swan. We were kind of considering a two for one offer to get more competitive. A two for one promotion? Hmm. I kind of like the sound of that. It sounds like something we should consider. Yeah, exactly. Just what I was thinking. In fact, that's a brilliant idea. I'm glad we thought of that. Very creative. <laughs> Don't say. This is manager. Okay. Try the sales. It means increase the sales. Okay. Let's try, try to increase the sales. Drive the sales. Okay. Well, more than we will have to to match the competitors. To match the competitors. Okay. So the price or to match lower price to match the competitors. Okay. So get you know competition, comp good things. Oh, uh, the same level. That means keep the same level of uh, with these competitors to match the competitors, okay? And uh, what kind? It's never fly, so it's not possible. It's, it will not get success in swim. It it will never fly with swim. It will never, it will never fly with swim. As a better plan, promotion. Yeah, two for one. That's something bad idea. People come on, you will. Uh, Will be here any minutes. Yeah, he'll be here any minutes. Okay. Do we have any ideas yet? Oh, uh, two for one. Yeah. It sounds of that. Yeah, we should consider. Like something we should. Exactly what I think. In fact, brilliant idea. <laughs> oh my god, very creative.